discussed Pythagorean triplets. Today we can continue. Today's topic is square roots. Finding square roots. How to find the square root of a number? We can check. The inverse operation of addition is subtraction and the inverse operation of multiplication is division. So finding the square root is the inverse of squaring. We know how to find the square of a number. That is 1 square is equal to 1. So square of 1 is 1. So the inverse operation means the square root of 1 is 1. That is 1 square is equal to 1. So square root of square root of 1 is 1 that is actually square root of 1 is plus 1 or minus 1 how you know that is plus 1 into plus 1 is equal to 1 and minus 1 into minus 1 also 1 so square root of 1 we can say plus or minus 1 but we are taking only positive natural number square root what's positive number square root only we are taking so square root of 1 is 1 we can say same way 2 square is equal to 4 so square root of 2 4 is 2 square root of 4 is 2 same way 3 square is equal to 9 so square root of 9 is 3 Okay, actually plus or minus 3 but we are taking only positive square root. Same way 4 square is equal to 16. So square root of 16 is 4. And 5 square is equal to 25. So the square root of 25 is 5. Square root of 25 is 5. Same way it will Continue. So this way we can find the square root of any number. That is. And the symbol of square root is symbol of square root. Square root symbol. That is the symbol only we are using. The square root of 16 is 4. That is 4 into 4 is equal to 16. So square root of 16 is 4. Then square root of 100 is equal to 10. That is 10 into 10 is 100. So square root of 10 and 100 is 10. Then square root of 121 is equal to 11. It is 11 into 11 is equal to 121. So square root of 121 is equal to 11. Then square root of 49 is equal to 7. That is 7 into 7 is equal to 49. So square root of 49 is equal to 7. Hope you all understood. Next topic. Finding square roots through repeated subtraction. As you all know. Every square number can be expressed as the sum of successive n odd natural numbers starting from 1. The sum of first n odd natural numbers is n square also. Then, now we can check how to find square root of 36 using this method. Okay, as you all know, what are the odd numbers, consecutive odd numbers? 1, 3, 5, 7, 9, 11, 15, 17, etc. It will continue. Continues infinitely. So, root 36. First step, step 1. Step. You have to subtract first odd number from the even number. Square root of 36 only we are going to find. That is 36 minus 1. That is 35. Then step 2. 35 minus second odd natural number. That is 3. 35 minus 3 is 32. Okay. Then third step. 32 minus 
third what natural number 32 minus 5 that is 27 then fourth one fourth step 27 minus 7 7 is the fourth or natural number that is 20 g okay then fifth step 20 minus 9 20 minus 9 is 11 okay then sixth step 11 minus which is the next or natural number 11 11 minus 11 is 0. So you have to check which step we will get 0. Then that is the so here step 6 only we got 0. So 6 is the square root of 36. So this is the method to find the square root through repeated subtraction. So step 6 only we got 0. So square root of 36 is 6 but this is the this is very easy but because 36 means we, from the sixth step we got the answer but it will be time consuming if the number is if, if it is a bigger number it will take more time so that is the limitation so another method also there factorization method that we can study in the next class that is well. Thank you.